Hey guys. Today's video we are talking about best earbuds with active noise cancellation. If you are looking buds with great sound, long lasting battery life, active noise cancellation and some more. So don't worry, Samsung Galaxy Buds Live provides you all the features you required. If you are want to know much more information check link mentioned in the description below. He Galaxy Buds Live are Samsung's latest truly wireless earbuds, and as with any new product, Samsung hyped them up quite a bit. With the weird new design that lends them the Bean's nickname, the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live are sure to turn some heads. But the design isn't everything that goes into a pair of wireless earbuds. There's also the audio quality and battery life, of course, but also the supported features. We're here today to talk about those features, both included and excluded, and how the combination of what Samsung put in make the Galaxy Buds Live perhaps the most feature-rich wireless earbuds to date, especially if you have a Samsung Galaxy device. First up, let's talk about the features that Samsung did include in the Galaxy Buds Live. There are quite a few, so strap in, and let's get started. Something that's becoming increasingly popular in the earbuds space is active noise cancellation. This feature uses input from the microphones and the earbuds to generate a sound wave of the opposite phase to what it hears. This has the effect of reducing ambient noise much more effectively than passive solutions, like noise isolation. To activate ANC on the buds, you have to touch and hold on one of the two earbuds, which is the default touch and hold action for both earbuds. You'll then hear a beep indicating that ANC is active. To turn ANC off, simply touch and hold again until you hear another beep. Samsung usually does a really good job of tuning the audio of its TWS earbuds, landing its products at the top of audiophile recommended lists but audio quality is subjective, and not everyone will be a fan of the default equalizer tuning. Fortunately, Samsung offers a few equalizer presets you can pick from. These include the default normal, bass boost, soft, dynamic, clear, or treble boost. Sadly, you can't customize the equalizer settings, but there are third-party apps that can do that. Samsung designs its products to work well with Microsoft Windows, and the Galaxy Buds Live are no different. When you put your Galaxy Buds Live in pairing mode near a PC running Windows 10, you'll get a pop-up notification with a button that lets you quickly pair your PC to them. When you're out and about listening to music on the go, hopefully while social distancing, you want to minimize how often you pull out your phone. Checking notifications is one of the main reasons people pull out their phone, and the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live has a feature that eliminates that need. You can have the Galaxy Buds Live read notifications aloud to you. During an incoming call, you can even have the earbuds say the phone number if the contact isn't recognized or the name if the contact is saved. A lot of true wireless earbuds also lack adequate gesture controls. So many TWS earbuds ship only with two gestures, which usually include double and triple tap. It makes for a pretty limiting experience when you can only execute two actions without using your phone. Luckily, the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live ditched this trend by adding two more gestures, single tap and tap and hold. Thus, you can have a single tap, double tap, triple tap, and touch and hold gesture. Here are the default gesture actions on the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live. Single tap. Play a track. Pause a track. Double tap. Play the next track. Answer or end a call. Place the current call on hold and answer a second incoming call. Switch between a current call and a call placed on hold. Triple tap. Play previous track. Start the current track over at the beginning. Touch and hold. One second. Activate a custom shortcut, active noise cancelling, voice command, volume up or own, launch Spotify. Decline a call. Turn the microphone on or off during a call. Retrieve a call placed on hold after ending the current call. Three seconds. Start pairing mode. What's interesting about the volume up or down gesture is that you can continue holding to lower or raise the volume as much as you want. With a lot of other earbuds, there's no way to even change the volume without pulling out your phone. The Samsung Galaxy Buds Live gets the best of both worlds, though. The charging case supports both USB-C and wireless charging. Have your Galaxy Note 10 on hand but not a power adapter, or only one adapter? No problem. Just enable wireless power share and put the Galaxy Buds Live case on the back of your phone. Wireless PowerShare is a feature of the Samsung Galaxy Note 20, Galaxy Z Fold 2, Galaxy S20, Galaxy Z Flip, Galaxy Note 10, and Galaxy S10. But if you don't have any of these phones, you can also use any Qi wireless charger to charge the Galaxy Buds Live. Gaming Mode, or Game Mode, is another common feature of true wireless earbuds, and it's essentially a low-latency mode for your earbuds. 
It lowers the audio delay at the cost of overall audio quality, which can be useful in a shooter game and insanity preventing when watching a YouTube video. The Galaxy Buds Live comes with Samsung's own version of gaming mode, which might make them an attractive option for mobile gamers. It only works if you pair the Buds Live to a Samsung phone, though. With earbuds the size of beans, there's a possibility that you'll lose one or both of them. Hopefully, you haven't misplaced them too far away, but you may be able to find them with the Find My Earbuds feature of the Galaxy Buds Live plugin. This will play a loud beeping sound from your earbuds that you might be able to pick up if you're close by. Long battery life is arguably one of the most important features of any pair of truly wireless earbuds. No one wants to be listening to their favorite song only to be interrupted by a low battery warning. Unfortunately, with active noise cancellation enabled, the Galaxy Buds Live is only going to provide about 6 hours of battery life before they need to be charged. With ANC disabled, that number goes up to about 8 hours. The Samsung Galaxy Buds Live are IPX2 rated for water slash sweat resistance. That means they can resist water hitting them at a 15 degrees angle or less. The Samsung Galaxy Buds Live has an absolute ton of features, maybe even a ton. While they may be missing a small number of features, Samsung's strategy of including everything it possibly can in its products is sure to attract plenty of customers, especially if they already own other Samsung products. If you're interested in the Samsung Galaxy Buds Live, Samsung offers them in three color variants, Mystic Bronze, Mystic Black, and Mystic White. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please hit the subscribe button. See you in the next video.